What's cracking you two? My name is Brody and welcome back to part number two of my box two breakthrough opening. That sounded sweet. But yeah, anyway, without further ado, if you have not seen part number one, I'll leave a link on the screen or in the description below. Um, make sure you go check that out because that part was amazing. The pause in these breakthrough boxes, like I said in my last box opening, is just insane. But yeah, we're going to crack into another nine packs in this part. And I'll see you guys in a sec. I'm just going to trim the tops off these packs. Alrighty guys, and we're back. So I've trimmed the tops off these good looking packs down here. We got a nice variety, not sorted out into pack arts this time, just completely random. But yeah, let's go. Let's go. So the last part was pretty, pretty strong. We got some, some goodness. I'm hoping to continue that in this part, because this box is... I, I, I have high hopes, very high hopes for this box. But anyway, let's go. So we got a Pample, a Cyndaquil, Staryu, Professor's Letter, Haunter. I wonder if we can start it off strong today. We've got a Rainbow Energy, cool. And that's a Reverse, with a Braviary Regular Rare. Not bad. So it has a Wing Attack and Dual Cut. Dual Cut, flip two coins as attackers, any damage times the number of heads. So you have the potential of, what is it? And 80 damage time. 240 maybe? Is that how it works? Either 160 or 240. Something like that. 4 energy for that too. But that's a little bit a little bit risky, especially with that 2 to retreat cost. But here's the code for this pack. And let's go. Ooh, a storm's brewing outside right now. Oh. I wonder if you guys can hear that through the mic. Oh, that thunder, that roll. Scary. I'm trying to record. Hopefully, hopefully my computer doesn't shut down. <laughs> I'm, I'm scared. Oh, I get scared when trimming off the tops of the packs as well, but that storm is is a bit risky. We got a reverse red Noctowl, not bad. And a Mammoth Swine Hollow. Cool. So we got double rares. So this Mammoth Swine has thick fat. The ability thick fat. Th thick fat. Oh, say that ten times. And primordial boom. That's awesome. Hopefully my computer doesn't shut down. <laughs> Otherwise there'll be no face cam. And that'll be a little bit that'll suck. Two, three, because we're heading into summer and the closer we get to summer, um at the time of this recording, the more storms that there are in Australia we get we get smashed by storms in summer. We got Q Bone. Especially at this time, because for example, uh, just for a fun fact, I'm recording this at about six o'clock, and we get our storms usually uh, late afternoon. It's just like predictable. Hits hits about late afternoon, and we just get smashed by a, sometimes by a really bad storm. But yeah, let's see if this part can pick it up. We got Cacnea, Snova, Froakie. Azorua, Chesspin, Ursaring, Stunfisk, Spupa, and a Noivern Break. Can we get the McDouble? That's the question. So we got Noivern Break with Synchro, Synchro Wolfer. Synchro Wolfer. So what's that do? If you have the same number of cards in your hand as your opponent, this attack does 80 more damage. Nice. And... Hey right you. So he couldn't get the double. But it's all good. It's all good. Next pack. Three on her. Hoping to get some full arts. We gotta get these full arts. There's not many in this set, which is very surprising for how large it is. But let's hope. One of the full arts, just basic full arts I'd be really hoping to get is the Mega Mewtwo X full art because that thing is just awesome. So we got a Go-Go, that one's just an uncommon, and a Haxorus Hollow. Q 
kill. So we get Dragon Dance, Shark Fang, and Dragon Pulse. Dragon Pulse is a little bit risky because you have to just discard the top three cards of your deck. But the amount of energies you have to use to use those attacks, that could be could be interesting. Someone could make it work, I bet. Someone out there would be able to make it work. Well, code. And hopefully we can get some glossy goodness in this pack. But we have Chespin, Rufflet, Woobat, Chespin number two, Starly, a breaks in, Rainbow Energy, Pilo Swine, Scatterbug, I thought that was Chespin. Ooh. And a Houndoom EX. Mega Houndoom, sorry. Look at this card. Look at how the green just pops on that red. It's, little, it's like Christmas. Red and green. No, oh, it's more orange, actually. The orange and green. Look at the flames down the bottom there. But yeah, it has Inferno Fang. What does that do? You may discard all fire energy attached to this Pokemon if you do. This attack does 80 more damage. Interesting. The if there, if there was such a thing as like a double fire energy instead of like a double colorless, this could be um could be pretty sweet. But till then, we just have Houndoom hanging up the back there. So yeah, the art looks really nice. The once again, I'm just a big fan of full art. So if I got like the Mega Houndoom full art, that would be amaz amazing as well. But we have Monkey Pants here. Vanillite, Ice Cream Cone, another monkey. Then we get Ralts, we get the Mushroom. We get Zerua, Fracture, Cacturn, a Wobbuffet, and a Fracture Reverse, so that's two Fracture, one pack. And an Empoleon Hollow. Fire out this pack. This this part is just jam-packed, eh? So let's throw... Oh, actually, let's have a look. Have a look at this. Dignified Fighter. Each of your basic Pokemon attacks does 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon before applying weakness or resistance. Hydro Splash, 70 damage for 2 energy. I've noticed a lot of cards in these set just require like next to no energy to um use their attacks, which is pretty interesting. Let's go. Second last pack of this part, we have a Magnemite. Pikachu, Inkay, Chespin, Duduo, Piloswine, an Assault Vest, an Ice Cream Cone, Level 2 <laughs> Reversed, and we have a Zoroark Break. Let's go. Definitely one of the breaks that you want to pull because of a foul play. You can definitely do something with that. It's like you can use it, um, one of your opponents attacks against them of their active Pokemon that is for one energy once again like minimal energy but uh, the reward is there and we have a Simis here regular air with water fling and hand fling but yeah Zoroark hang up back look at this part like that stack at the back uh, is going to be a mish to sort out after this pack but yeah, let's... I couldn't really ask it too much more, actually. If we if we don't get anything in this pack, then... It's all good. Exhausted Tackle. Very fitting attack name for the art. I like that. I like that. Skiddo. Staryu. A. Paris. Frogadier. Judge. Granbull. Giovanni Scheme Reverse. And... A. Noctowl Regular Air. So that's all good. It's all good because we have a crazy, crazy stack up the back here. Let me just sort this out quickly for you guys. So there's a couple here to go through. So I'm going to go reverses, then hollows, then EX, and then we'll go break. Actually, swap those around. There we go. Okay, so we've got the Noctowl Reverse Rare, so that's pretty sweet. We've got the Mamo Swine Hollow, a Haxorus Hollow, an Empoleon Hollow. 
We've got the Mega Houndoom EX. And then we have a Neumann brake. And then we had the Zoro brake. So that's pretty crazy. Look at those brakes. What's um let me know in the comments what's your favorite out of these two brakes. I I got a good feeling that Zoro would be the fan fave, but who knows? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed this part, and I'll see you guys in part number three. Thanks for watching. Peace.